Here's my newest little toy. There's the other one I built, the 31 plate one. But here's my newest one. It's a 16 plate, uh, six by six, and uh, it's got pretty impressive results. I get actually get better results off this one than I do the big one. Uh, I got it hooked up right now. Here's my water reservoir. My battery charger I'm running at 12.4, 12.5 volts. And I'm running right now, I don't know if you can see it, but I'm running at 9 amps. I think the sun glare is kind of messing up on seeing it on the camera, but I'm running 9 amps. I'm fixing to do a, a, a liter per minute test. And uh, let me set my camera down right here if I can get it to sit down without it falling over. All right. There's my water bubble in there. I got my cell phone, got a stopwatch on it. Let me get it started. I'm going to do a liter per minute test. Alright, here we go with the cell phone. I start the timer. Then I'm gonna... I got a one liter bottle here full of water. I'm going to put the hose in at uh, 10 seconds, right now. And uh, just like the other fuel cell, I have no bottom holes, just top holes. All the way across the unit. I'm using a uh, 1 16th inch neoprene as a gasket. And a uh, PVC cutting board on, uh, on the end plates. About half there. It's almost to my mark. I don't know if you can see the mark or not. And time. That was uh, 52 seconds. Minus the 10 for the start. So 42 seconds for one liter of gas. Now I'm going to go inside and uh, figure my M MW out. And uh, now I'm going to post this video. Well, that's my new little toy. That's probably the one I'm going to put on my car because that one there is too big. I ain't got nowhere to mount it. That's just going to be my experimental cell. And uh, this is my new one. And I'll probably fix to build an 8x8 one uh, as soon as I get the time to. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll have the uh, MMW posted in the video.